Today, obviously a fantastic round. I saw you staring back at the little leaderboard there on 18. It's uh, still a great round, but the script is just so far ahead. It's hard. Yeah, well, you know, I was starting the day, I was still too far back. You know, but, you know, I made a good run. You know, I knew if I played a good round today, then, you know, I could get up there maybe in the top five. And that's, you know, that's what I was trying to do. But, you know, um, I felt like I played really well all week, just didn't, uh, you know, just didn't score that well. But, you know, today I finally, you know, got out of my round what I thought I should have. So, you know, it's nice. You know, I finally feel like, you know, my game's coming around and I'm starting to play a little better. Coming this around right? just in time. Obviously, U.S. Open two weeks away and uh, it came so close last year. Is this uh, momentum for you, you hope? Yeah, for sure. You know, um, you know, I've been struggling a little bit all year. You know, I just hadn't really been that consistent. You know, I've had some good weeks and, you know, had some really bad weeks. So, you know, I finally feel like the game, you know, last week I played, you know, fairly well. And, um, you know, this week I've, I've really... You know, the game turned around. I'm starting to hit a lot of good golf shots. I'm driving in the fairway and, you know, holding some putts. So, you know, I'm, I'm definitely excited about going into the U.S. Open. Most of the, well, all of the major champions now currently are European or foreign. Uh, how nice would it be to have an American, either yourself or somebody else, compete and win the U.S. Open? <laughs> yeah, well, you know, obviously that would be nice. Uh, you know, I think, you know, Americans, we're playing really good right now. But, you know, the Euros are tough. I mean, a lot of good players, and you know they've been playing well in the majors. So you know one of us is going to have to step up and get a W at, at the end. So. Dustin, do you see any? Uh, you've probably been asked this before. Hell, I probably asked you this before. I just can't remember. Um, you know, there have been some. The 54 hole leaders in the majors in the last three of the last four had trouble getting off the course with their hiding tag on Sunday. Is that just a matter of being a first-time guy, young guy in that position? Is there a common thread there that you see? Well, I mean, if you see it, like, what was it, me, Matt Roy, and Bobby? I mean, it was our first time playing the lead at a, at a major. So, you know, it's a, it's definitely a lot different. You know, you can you say whatever you want, you know. I mean, I even had a really good warm-up on Sunday when I had a three-shot lead. You know, got off to, you know, had a good first hole, hit it right down the middle on two. But, you know, just one, you know, I made triple on two after driving right down the middle and I put a wedge in my hand. So, you know, it's not, you know, it's a funny game. So it's definitely, you know, it's definitely tough. And, you know, to, to know what that situation is like and, you know, to know what to expect in that situation is definitely a bonus. You, know? you kind of turned right around at the PGA and shook it all off and were right there until the yeah. 72nd hole. So. Yeah, no, I mean, you know, the PGA, I played great all day long. You know, just an unfortunate situation on the last hole, but... You know, I, I still, you know, I knew what to expect in the situation. I knew what was, you know, you know what what I needed to do to, to succeed. So, you know, it definitely helped me. You know, failing at the, at the U.S. Open, we're just you know really struggling. You know, definitely was a learning a learning curve, and you know, I used that to help me at the PGA. So, you know, even at, you know, at the U.S. Open, if I get in the same situation, I'm going to expect. What's the biggest element or difference between 54 hole lead in the majors compared to 54 hole lead in the regular? Event? There's no parties. Oh, <laughs> can't get it back. It, it's not. It, it's a, it's definitely a little bit different, but you know, obviously it's a little bit bigger tournament. But they all, I mean, they all mean a lot. So you always want to win them. But you know, just just being in the situation is is what's the biggest part. You know, you know, learning from that situation so the next time you're in it, you know what to expect and you know how to react. So. But it's, uh, you know, it's just tough, especially just, for a first time. This weather delay going to hurt or help the guys still left on the course? I have no idea. <laughs> it, you know, sometimes it, it fares, it fares uh, good to you, but sometimes it hurts you. But, you know, Steve's out there. He's playing really good golf right now. So I, I would have to imagine he's going to hold on. You're talking you about Steve out there. Yeah. Obviously, he's tearing it up. Can you just talk a little bit about his game? Are you impressed with what he's doing? Talking about how inconsistent you've been. That guy seems like he never takes a week off, and he's on the board always. Uh, well, you know, last year I played really consistently for about six months. Right, the last six months of the year. So, you know, just just struggling a little bit. But uh, you know, I finally feel like I'm back in, you know, back in form. But you know, I'm a player that I do. And that's what I'm looking for. Yes, yeah, Steve is a great guy. I mean, you know, he's got a great game. You know, not too much. You know, he drives it really straight. And, as everyone knows, he cuts the shit out of it. So, you know, you can't, it's, it's hard to, you know, it's just, this is a great golf course. You know, hitting fairways and then hitting greens, 
you know, it, it doesn't matter how far away from the hole you are, you've got a good look at it. Have you ever put him with that heel up style that, you know, with the, like a toe down, heel up, you know what I mean? That he does? It's, yeah, I mean, it's, uh, Nobody else out here does it. Few guys do it. Kind of bend, they usually bend the putter to make it more upright so that it sits, you know what I mean? So yeah, it I mean, it's flat. just, he's been doing it for so long. I mean, putting, everybody does it different. I mean, there's a lot of good putters out here, they all put it different. So it's just all about repetition. Yeah, well, just, just make off. as many birdies as you can. It's all, it's all you can do. It's just, you know, try to get off to a real good start. Maybe, maybe put some pressure. Be changed this morning. Try to qualify for the old and that's what I was talking about. What do you think about that, guys? Did you try? No, the first time I tried was my rookie year. I've never tried. Thank you.